what's up what's up you guys so today's video is going to be a beautiful color wig which is by a company that i've never worked with before which is called in color wig you guys this wig is so pretty the color is so pretty so i'm hoping and praying that it comes out looking nice so why go ahead and cut the lace off of the nape area and pray i'm gonna show you guys how your wig comes are we lost? Are we not? Are we real? Are we turning to dust? Do you feel what I feel? Have we changed so that much? Can we heal? You're not saying a word. Oh, it feels so unreal. Okay, you guys so I'm hoping and hoping for the best for this wig at least I was this is a voiceover so you know I already know what it looks like but I already went ahead and put the wig on you know as you guys can see and I'm not too sure about this lace color but we just gonna go ahead and go through this so as normal I'm just gonna go ahead and cut the lace with my threading snips I love these they're called thread snips for anyone who's interested you can just look on Amazon, look up thread snips. Super inexpensive. These were like four or five bucks. You can get them all different prices, but just don't pay a lot. But I love them. They don't get dull. They're super sharp and they make cutting a lot easier. So as you guys see, I went ahead and cut the lace. I did bleach this unit. Yes, girl, I bleached the knot and I did pre-pluck it as well. However, it does come pre-plucked for you. I have 24 inches going on here, hunties, with a 150% density volume. Now, the one thing about it, as you see my face right there, the wig was not fitting from ear to ear circumference, which means I didn't have to cut anything but the wig did not go all the way down to the sides as you see right there. But that's okay, hey, you know it is what it is. And that was on both sides. So it's a little bit tiny too small on the sides and not in the front. So it's not slipping back, it's not gonna slip back or anything. It's just that the lace does not meet all the way to where my ear is at. But hey, it's okay because as long as it fits the rest of the way, then your girl is good. Because I've had some wigs that did not fit properly at all. Um, and I wasn't going to glue or adhere this wig. So that's the reason why I went ahead and cut the baby hairs ahead of time. Then I realized, girl, just go ahead and just spray some hairspray on this bad boy. Because it's probably not going to hold down in certain areas because, girl, you know, it doesn't fit all the way. So I just decided to spray in certain sections like you see me doing here. So that way it can hold. And normally, you know me, I really want the sideburns to be held down. So I'm not really too concerned about the rest, okay? Because this mug is sitting really tight. Now, what I'm gonna do here is the normal. I'm just gonna jazz it up a bit with my styling mousse. Yes, girl, my styling mousse from the Dollar Tree. 
Now the color in this is absolutely beautiful. I love the color so freaking much in this. I love it. Like when they asked me to review this wig, I was like, yes, hunty. Cause I have seen quite a few thumbnails on YouTube of girls rocking this particular color. So I was definitely for it, okay. And as you guys know, this trusty, trusty stand standby green toothbrush is my favorite. I have been using the same green toothbrush for years. Of course, I've went ahead and cleaned it and washed it, but girl, it works perfectly for baby hairs, for any kind of hairs. So now what I'm gonna do is just I'm gonna take my elastic band that I have sewn together so nicely and allow it to hold my hairs down while I try to style it. Now that's where the actual sewing or the, the tracks begin. So you don't wanna go back too far, okay? So I just went ahead, look at the color, like look. That blonde highlight in the front is gorgeous, absolutely just gorgeous. But the hair is called a jerry curl texture hair and it is 24 inches in length and it's so pretty. It 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 actually, when I bleached it, it was so easy. The knots lifted with no problem at all. And of course the pre-pluction was perfect. It does come pre-plucked for you. So you don't have to if you don't know how to or you don't want to. But I did of course and um, very easy to dry. I hung it upside down to dry so that way you can have more curls. You know what I mean? And um, that's about it. I'm just going to brush these little baby hairs down to camouflage this lace because the lace was not um, my favorite. It wasn't matching or it just wasn't matching to perfection. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of this Even New York tinting spray and I'm going to just spray a little bit on the back of my hand and then take my makeup brush and just dab it in. This is what I like to do. You can do it on the inside of the cap or on the outer side. I wasn't un I wasn't aware that I was going to need to use this. So I wish I would have done this beforehand. But either way, the hair color is absolutely gorgeous. You can definitely check out In Color Wig. They have loads of different units on their website. This one comes in many different lengths, you guys. I feel so, so, so Fiesta-like. I really like this. It goes well with my freckles, so I'm feeling this color. I just wish the lace would have been a different color, but check them out. They have some really nice wigs. I hope you guys like the color. Look at my eye eyeshadow girl look. I was trying to do it up for this wig today. I really, really was. I was trying to look sexy for the wig color. I really do like the wig a lot. Like, I like the color. It's very frazzled and very wild. You can finger comb through it and make it as wild as possible i know for a fact if i put some heat to this and wand curl it it's probably going to look just even prettier but either way check out in color wig i will list their links and all of the information down below you know i did flip the i did use um the flip over method or not the flip over method excuse me but i did flip it over to the opposite side just to see how it would look and i kind of like it on this side laying better you know that's just my preference but you know you guys let me know what you think i'm trying to be seductive right here in this part to you guys just seductive but i love you all make sure you rate comment subscribe happy dance let me know what you think of this unit you know just the lace and that's about it i love you all and i'll see y'all soon. Bye.